Well, Jennifer Burns is teaching us how to make a healthy meal that we ought to listen to. It's high in protein, it's good for us, omega-3 fatty acids, and it's breaded, I hope. So we Okay, it's not we, breaded, is it? It's baked. <laughs> it's hard healthy. You won't miss the breading, Dan, I promise, because we put so much flavor into it. You could do that with maybe some whole grain breadcrumbs, though. He was talking about having it breaded. Oh, yeah. So. yeah. But look at our beautiful, beautiful catfish there that we just season really well, and that's the whole key of uh, enjoying something like a white fish. Dill weed we put in there, Sarah, the oregano, mm -hmm. no salt seasoning, some pepper, but that lemon gives it so much flavor. Yeah. So whether you're baking it or just putting it in the pan, and when we put a little bit of canola based um, or olive oil based uh, butter, just a tiny pat, okay. and then some olive oil. So that's good to go. I'm going to plate it with some fresh basil here. Mm, delicious. So now, what are some of your patients at Intermountain Medical Center asking, you know, these days on how to stay heart healthy? I mean, yeah, it seems like our patients always ask us, what diet should I be on? And because it's so confusing these days, there's gluten free and low carb and high protein and all of these different options. So it can be really confusing when you're planning a meal or opening your refrigerator. Uh, but our doctors actually recommend the Mediterranean diet. Okay, and that's proven to reduce um, the risk of heart disease, is yeah, that right? It's true, proven to reduce the risk of heart disease and stroke. And it's the only diet, you know, a diet that's uh, actually been researched and um, extensively. There was a five-year study published in the New England Journal of Medicine that showed that it really does help lower your risk for heart disease and stroke, so. Oh, wow, that's great. Yeah. Now, what are the basics of the Mediterranean diet? Sure, so the Mediterranean diet is kind of like a pyramid, um, and at the bottom it has whole grains, fruits, and vegetables. So every Every meal you should base off those three things. And then on top of that, the next most important thing to eat is um, lean protein and fish, so poultry and fish. And then they want you to do sparingly the red meats, the butter, um, and sweets. Okay. So those are the basics. Okay, yeah. very good. And what's the best thing about the diet according to the experts at Intermount Medical sure. Center Heart Institute? Well, our experts have found that our um, our patients can actually stick with it because they're not counting calories and there's a nice. big variety on this diet. So you can really have um, a huge range of foods and it's yeah. not as limiting as maybe gluten-free or high protein can be. I love it. I love the Mediterranean. I mean, a lot of yeah. nuts, a lot of olives, Absolutely. you know, fish, olive oil. So, all right. Well, thank you so much for coming in. Look how pretty and just and serving it with just something like a steamed vegetable. Perfect yeah, it idea. looks beautiful. Yeah. You're not going to miss the breading, Dan, I promise. Oh, I believe it. I don't need the breading. No breading, extra uh -uh. flavor. Good to eat and good for you. All right. For the full recipe, visit box13now.com and search baked.